She's using the little board thing as a pillow to put her face. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Although it's almost six. Say hi, Rosie. Oh, how cute. Hey, guys. So, um, it is definitely really late to start vlogging. It's um, 5.47, but... Um, you know, like I've told you guys, I've been having a really, 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 really hard time with pain and being able to kind of even, you know, like wake up and move around. It's been really, really bad for like a week now. And um, so I actually didn't wake up until like 2.30. Um, there was one of the semifinal games that started um, at 2. So. I kind of looked at my phone, saw the time, and was like, oh man, I have to, I have to go, you know, I have to go watch this game. Um, but, uh, so I watched that, um, the team I wanted to win didn't win. I wanted Belgium to win, I don't know why, but I'm happy for France. Um, but, basically that's it. I've been hanging out with Rosie, she's just laying in the corner over there. Um, I've been catching up with my mom because I didn't get to see my parents last week, so I've been just talking to her about a lot of different things, um, trying to eat, I'm having some very bland food, but um, I am trying to eat, and um, I guess really my only plan for tonight is maybe work on my resume a little bit more, upload the vlog from yesterday, and, um, and read, I want to go outside. Well, it's cooling down and I want to just like read out on my deck um, and uh, yeah my mom just went to go get my dad from the train station and yeah, yeah that's pretty much it um, so uh, good morning guys um, I'll let you know how my night goes I hope everybody's doing okay so I went out for a walk with my mom. We went twice around, which I think is pretty much like a mile and a half, which is really, really good. Um, so I'm just hanging out. Got Rosie, my mom's coming inside. <laughs> mm -hmm. Not too good. And obviously I'm in bed, but I I was stupid and I tried eating just a mix of two, not a lot of either one, but like a mix of two that was like, it was a literal like recipe for disaster, like it was just such a bad idea. Because I was craving like several things at once, I'm so stupid. Um, and it's like that mixed with whatever I'm dealing with, with the, um, with the um, exhaustion, which I'm thinking maybe I had some random, um, maybe I had a random drop in my hemoglobin. I've, um, I'm anemic, but my levels have been good recently. The other thing that is really, really personal, um, that I, um, didn't talk about the past couple months, but, um, obviously it's the middle of July now. Um, I hadn't had my period until, um, like a couple of days ago since April and so I don't know if there's maybe some sort of correlation 
But the thing is, I, that's, it, it just doesn't seem possible that having my period for a few days would affect my hemoglobin, but it, it seems like, like it just, it doesn't make sense. It just really does not make any sense because, but it's just like such a strange mix of things because it's the extreme amount of exhaustion I'm having that's new, like it's been like this for like a week, mixed with having my period late, mixed with the fact that my blood pressure was like 76 over 55 today, and I checked it like 10 times, not 10, probably like 7 or 8 times, but I don't understand what's going on, like I just don't get it, and like I probably need to start seeing doctors again and kind of partially come off palliative care, um, but I just don't want to, and I don't know who to contact, I guess my GI and be like, hey, can you check my hemoglobin, <laughs> um, and my other red blood cell levels, I don't know what to do, I really don't know what to do, and I want it today to be like, a nice day at home where I watched some of the game and hung out with my mom, and it's been nice, but it's just like, this is exhausting. I did go for the walk. I'm proud of myself for doing that. But like, I just don't understand what's going on. I don't get it. But I, I guess I have to talk to somebody about it and I really don't want to. But I don't know. I don't know. Hopefully I can do some yoga tonight if I can get up off my bed, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to. I just wanted to let you guys know what was going on, especially tell you guys things that I've held back from talking about, so... Now you guys are informed. Hey, so it is, um, just about one... Sorry about those tremors. Um, I am going to do a yoga session, which I'm excited about. Um, when I first started doing yoga, like, four years ago or three years ago, um, I used this YouTube channel, uh, it's called Yoga with Adrian, and I used um, this other one, and I don't remember the name, but the other one was a lot more of like the advanced stuff, so I really liked her because she really pushed me. Um, and Yoga with Adrian, I felt at the time was too simplistic, and now looking back, like, she does, it's not like just the body stuff she does, she really, really does focus on the mind aspect of yoga. Um, and she has so many videos of like specific things, like what I'm looking at. Yoga for stress, uh, you know, meditation for humility. Like, she has all of this really, really, really uh, cool videos, you know, like flexibility, hips and lower back. Like, she has everything. Stress melt. Yeah, self doubt. I mean, she has everything. So, I just want to maybe pick one for tonight um, and do one. Um, so. That's basically what I'm going to do, and then just get back in bed and stay in bed. Um, I have the vlog from the other day exporting, so I'll, uh, I'll let you guys know what I chose, and I'll see you guys on the other side. Okay, so the practice I um, did was this movement medicine calming practice. If you guys want to check it out, 
it was really focusing on, you know, instead of like, okay, do this for 10 seconds, okay, do this for whatever period of time, this one was really, really, really focusing on how your body moves while you're breathing, so it's not, like, people can go at their own paces depending on how somebody's naturally breathing. I don't know how to explain it well, but, um, yeah, that's pretty much what it was. It was really, really nice, just very deep, um, becoming centered kind of, you know, kind of practice, but, um, I really liked it. So, um, I will talk to you guys tomorrow. I'm going to close out the vlog. We do have to drive out on a little road trip for my pain management appointment. So me and my mom are going to, um, you know, have to make the, uh, long-term drive. Not long-term, the longer drive, um, in the middle of the day, so. Um, I will see you guys tomorrow, though, and thank you everybody for watching. I seriously adore every single one of you, and I'm so grateful, um, that you guys watch my videos and that, you know, you help support me, and I hope I can support you guys, too. But I'll see you tomorrow, guys. Good night, and I love you guys. Thank you.